What's up, everybody? Today we're in Lightworks. This is the program I use to uh, to edit my videos, and I've had this for over a year. I was doing month to month for a few months, and then I went for a yearly subscription. It ran out. I had to get a started a month, another month to month, and then I had to get an update. I guess this came out in May 2021, but it just recently gave me the update. And since then, my video quality has been horrible. At least the past two videos. Zombie Killer told me in Discord that I was having a problem or you know the, the quality wasn't as good as normal and I really didn't know so I was you know I was happy to, that he told me and so I could figure out what was going on and then like I found out it was apparently I was ex exporting to 24 FPS which like this video here um it, that's the only option it gives me 24 FPS so it's like what's going on and then I was messing around. I went on to the forums, tried to get some help there. And, you know, I'm, I had no idea what the hell I'm doing in this, this video editing. I can do some basic stuff. But, you know, they asked me some questions, and I'm like, I have no clue what you're talking about. So, but eventually I kept on messing with this for hours and hours. Like, this guy asked me what's my frame rate settings on my sequence timeline. I don't, I don't know. I have no idea what the hell he's talking about. No idea. But they were trying to help me and uh, suggested I do a few things and, and it wasn't what I was having a problem with. But then I was just testing crap out and then I go to export this one and then I can export this one at 60 FPS. So I was like, what the hell's going on? How come I could do this one, but not the other one? They're both the same video. And then eventually after, I don't know, an hour, hour and a half of messing with this, I finally figured out what I was doing wrong. Like we go to create new project um, this is different than it used to be. It used to have other options. We're just going to put test 2 here. And then you used to be able to set your frame rate. You can't do that now. And then we're going to go to uh, local files. Files this is a little bit different. And it's going to go to the Subnautica video. Same exact file I used for those other two projects. One project was 24 FPS. And then another one let me do it at 60. And then I finally figured out what the hell I was doing wrong. So I used to be able to double click and it would import it. You can't do that now, it just gives you some information. And then you click whatever you want, you hit import. And then I would go to edit. And then I would just drag this crap down here. And then it's kind of weird. If you notice, it just kind of dragged weird. Actually, let's back that one up because it kind of, it's even worse than it normally was. Okay, so that's how it came down. I was like, it looks weird. I didn't know what the hell was going on, so I would just drag it over here, and I would go through my editing. But this was a big mistake, because you don't know if you noticed, but there's two things highlighted here. And that is my problem. And if I go to export, it's only going to give me 24 frames per second. Now, if I undo all this crap, you notice that I pulled it down and it had a 2 there. When I go from log to edit, before it was just one file here. It wasn't no sequence one. It would just be like my Subnautica below zero video. And then I would just take this, um, you know, I just drag it down there. So I didn't really pay attention that there's two there. But I need to unselect them, select this one thing, and then drag it down here. Now I can export at 60 frames per second. And that's what is my problem. I was dragging both of these stupid things down here. And it was, I guess, giving me two different frame rates or something I don't I don't know how all this crap works I'm an idiot uh, I was in the army for 22 years and I didn't really have to do much with computers so video editing is not my forte I can do basic stuff I can you know I go through my video look at it uh, put a little marker there and then put another marker where I want to cut it out I may add a few transitions uh, little wipes or whatever maybe add some gamma or whatever but I don't do a whole lot of stuff and then audio sometimes I'll I'll lower the sound of one or the other but it's just basic stuff that I'm doing and this was you know it was giving me a hard time trying to figure out what it is but this is my problem hopefully this will help you if you're having the same issue and if not, maybe the people at Lightworks will better be able to understand what the hell is actually your issue. But thanks for watching, and I'll catch y'all later.